The protest has lasted for five days today, and we have been hoping that the His Excellency is a man of is a man of people, and we think it will have been here to address us. All those issues will have been put to bed. It won't be we won't be here today to be doing this. But the governor has been adamant to our. Matters. That is the reason why we have to observe the two months here today. What we can say for now is that uh, there are a lot, a, a, a lot of issues that the governor has refused to address. And we have written severally, the Central Labor Union has written, the Joint Action Committee of All Trade Unions in our state has equally written, written the government. But up till now, we've not seen any reply. From government. I love it when you say workers are taken to prayers. We believe in God and up to God is human. The portion of the scripture says people are his inheritance. Whatever God himself, whatever he does, he, his weapon has been man to achieve his aim. We are appealing to God and believing God that uh, God will have uh, something in the minds of us, many people that are concerned on the issues on ground so that we will resolve in a good time. We are people of peace. As you can see, from Monday, it's been peaceful. Though we, we had an experience where they planted some people to disrupt the whole thing from their own end. We are aware of that. Whatever litigation they want to take it up, we are prepared for that as well. It has been peaceful. I've been saying before now, the position of NLC is the same as the position of TUC. We are working together in tandem. There is no discord. There is no disparity. So we are together 100%. So just like he said, we are praying today to God. And basically, we are praying to God to remove everything that could have been like an hindrance uh, from the will of our governor that has been on him, that has not made him to come here. That's what we are praying for. We want God to open his eyes. The Congress will review our activities for, for the whole week. So it could be during the weekend, then we are not going to take another position. But I want to believe, I have belief in God, because this is a family matter, you know. And then we, if you consider where we are coming from, you will not pray for this kind of a thing. I want to believe that before the week runs out, before Sunday, things would have taken another shape. I want to believe that the Father will appear to, you know, it sounds like you know address us. Uh, we just finished uh, praying uh, uh, Jumat prayer here, and we are still waiting for our employer to call you in person of Governor Sheima Kende. So we are still waiting, and we are hopeful that he would come to meet us because he was with us at the labor house when he came to campaign for his second term. And whether you like it or not, he belongs to us, and we want to see him now. So we are still waiting.
Mwalele, that is a lady, one 